what's going on ladies and gentlemen this is demo storm and we're back with our uh chinchilla slash jeroboa taming army i know they're not chinchillas but you know i think they call them chinchillas they're giant uh jeroboa still exists so that puts a perspective on things look them up on the internet you can buy them they're like little mice uh but i thought today i was gonna tame up a couple more i want to get like 40 before the end of the series um, I'm working on getting Primitive Plus onto my server that I'm going to start my next series of Arc on. Um, I haven't checked out Primitive Plus since Valhalla days, which is probably three or four seasons backwards. So that's pretty exciting to check out, uh, Primitive Plus. Especially I haven't checked it out since it became free LC. Or whatever you want to call it when DLC is free. And we're going to turn that back on because I can't fucking see all right, we need to eat a couple of pieces of meat. I brought enough resources so I can get a bunch of these guys. But I need to find them. I thought I was going to carry them around on this bracer's back. I destroyed the cannon. No big deal. I don't plan on taming any more earth elementals right now. But I do need to find the magical Jeroboa. I feel like I'm going back at base. I saw a lot more. Where do I usually see a bunch of Jeroboas? I feel like on that hill. But I thought I would bring the Paracer to hold them because I want to have like almost like an, a warning device that's over necessary. Um, you know what I mean? They're all going to scream at the exact same time when a sandstorm comes or something. And I want to be able to like people just to laugh their asses off when you see it. It's going to be nutty. Oh, Paracer. Alright, you're going to follow me. That's the best method. Come on, buddy. He's just sitting there eating. What? There are many questions about this. Game, why you do? Yeah. <laughs> Stupid Veracer. I should never question flying Veracers. It's just something with this map. I find kangaroos in trees. Alright, he's gonna fuck off. So, we'll let him get away. He'll probably get attacked by some other type of creature that wants to kill him. Oop. There's one of our buddies. Oh, where are you, buddy? Thank you. And then someone let me know in the comment section that these are kibble. I didn't even have to go that far to find Jarabos. I don't know why. Did you just crush him? No, he's right here. But I'm going to load them up inside of my little adobe hut. What? Where, where did they go? No, Jarabos. Oh, no. Plan is not working. Plan is failing. Plan is failing. How? How does this happen? So I guess you guys will not stay inside of a freaking inside a house on a parasite's back. That's kind of annoying. Hmm. Very strange. But here they come. Oh, don't get stuck on the tree now. There's one stuck up on a rock. Ugh. But, uh, yeah, I don't plan on naming all of them. That is not a thing. It would not be my favorite thing to do. Come on, Jeroboas. Look at how fast they are. Okay. And we get our next one. So I guess I'm going to have to fill my house full of them. Because Mr. Paracer doesn't work. Alright, buddies. Come with me. We will figure out a plan for you guys. I want to put them in a giant tower. One of you is missing. Yep. Recent team. Thank you. Ugh. Much better, such while. 
But yeah, the, I like the Jeroboas, and I, I'm excited for Primitive Plus. Um, Scorched Earth is getting a little boring. There's not much else I can do. Um, I mean, I could run inside of the caves by myself. You guys could watch me die a couple hundred times. It, it just doesn't add up. <laughs> it doesn't seem like an enjoyable experience. Hello. Lystro? Is that a Lystro? Yeah. Back in the day. But I, I can't wait to go back to taming freaking spinos and all those other things that are missing on this map at the moment. Um, I don't know what they're going to do in the future. I hope they add like a scorched earth zone to maps. Like just make it so people can't use it if they don't buy the DLC or something. You know, Arma does that. If you guys ever played Arma 3, if you don't have a DLC, some of the guns you can't even pick them up. Like you need to buy this DLC to use these guns. I mean, I'm just talking about Arma 3 Wasteland and stuff that I run into it, but you guys get my drift if you guys are Arma people. Can we not? Can we, can we not hug? I, I am not in a respectable mood to be hugged by a Gallimimus. That's a dead carnet. Oh, yep. Yep. Thank you, buddy. Keep it to like a three. He should be fine in front of the base. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, a buddy of mine is just letting me know there's a wine tasting over at his store. But, uh, I don't... I'm not a wine person. I don't know why. I never got into wine. I, I feel like it has this too sweet of a taste. Like, there's a... My father's a big Moscato guy, and that's, that tastes like mosquito spray to me. It, it smells and tastes the same as, like, spraying mosquito spray on your arm and then having it, like, go in your mouth or something. That's 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 the feeling I get when I drink Moscato. Uh, sangria is good because I like to eat the fruit. I can do that, like a red wine. But past that point, me. Nee. Most of the other wines have a weird taste to them. I, I mean, I don't even like grape soda, so. Many wines are out of question. It is getting dull. Very, very dark. Yo, uh, stay asleep. Ooh, that almost killed you. I am sorry, female Jeroboa. I mean, I could breed these guys. I know you can breed them. And it's about to get real dark. Use our light source over there. Yep. The army is, the army is being built. It's, it reminds me of the time when I used to tame dodos all the time. Just tame shitloads of dodos. The eggs were good. And then there was a hatred of dodos in the beginning of the game. Oh no, you must have woke up. No? Alright, cool, bro. Oh, not this crap again. Thank you. So it takes three plant Y seeds. Not bad at all. Come on, buddy. We're gonna try and hover around the arc in uh, its light source for now. I know you guys can't see well. There's no gamma on the server at the moment. My charcoal pits. Come on, buddy. Oh, right. Sure. Always can do that. <laughs> I can't wait till Havoc comes online and just sees Jeroboa. Jeroboa. Everywhere. There's a Gallimimus letting himself on fire over there. Ow. Oh no, that was a bad idea. I'm more scared of the Parazer. Like meat. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Go pass the fuck out, Parazer. Hey, 
pain in my ass. All right, let's go get our new, new compadre. All right, we got another one. Let's find one before we return to base. If they just keep spawning here, I, I'll, I will do what I do in Slime Rancher and just sit there and tame as many as I can in one sitting. That would be exciting. Hmm. Let's see. Any more around here? I think I see one. Nope, you're a Lystro. Another Lystro. I mean, if I wanted the XP gain, I could do that. Not that big of a deal, really. I haven't done much with, like, crafting or needing EXP in a while. It's just one of those things. I mean, the Procopted on Saddle was about it. Did that. That's that point. All right, so we got three, six, seven. All right, we're, we're almost one-fourth of the way of where I want to be. Forty. <laughs> that's, that's my dream, you know, spot, really. All right, we'll just keep this this kind of circular motion. Um, traveling the map to get them was going to be my idea, but that didn't seem to work because racers are slow. If I could have a Quetzals on this map, oh, how I would just do it with a Quetzal. Just bring it right through. Just pick up every Jerobo I see, throw them right in the back of my Quetzal while I was, like, floating in the air. Come back, tame them all at once. Kind of what I used to do with Dodos. Because Dodo eggs equals kibble. <laughs> that's that's all it equals, and then you can get Tyranodons. Was it Tyranodons? Now my brain is all messed up. I'm ruining my brain thinking about old Ark boys. All right, let's see. Jeroboa. Jeroboa. Where thou shall be, un Jeroboa. Ugh. Stupid Jeroboa. Oh, I got our buddy Keith, the artist who drew my uh, template for my uh, thumbnails. Got me now wanting cashews really bad. He has sh sh unshelled cashews. So basically just a bag of unshelled cashews. Which here would cost me like fifteen, twenty dollars. Like that's mm, cashews, good stuff, good stuff. That are pist uh, not cashews, uh, pistachios. That's what I'm talking about, pistachios. Those things are expensive if they're not shelled. When they're shelled, they're expensive. They're in that like green bag. Oh, now I really want pistachios. Just crack them, eat them. Get all of that goodness. Right, let's, where are my Jeroboas? I might have to like expand my horizon of looking. But you guys will see me with 40 of them eventually. <laughs> um, I'll probably get as many as I can today on film. And then off cam, I'm just going to, you know, every time I see like three of them in those spawn points, pick them up. And then eventually come back. I don't know. I could always just cut and come back. But I want to get three videos done for you guys today. I'm going to be hitting a couple of games that I usually wouldn't play. You would be very surprised at the games I'm going to play. But, uh, yeah. I'm thinking about looking at, uh, 70s to die. I might check out H1Z1 with Mr. Boomer. As you've seen my brother do. But, uh, yeah, I need I need something new to play on top of Ark. Can't always just play Ark. Is that a Jeroboa? No, that is just dirt. <sighs> you know what? Screw it. We're going to cut back when I have a few more Jeroboas. Probably not 40, but when I have a few more. Because I need to just, like, find a spawn point and just fucking destroy it. Tame a bunch. Come back. Get them all. Come back. It's just going to be rinse and repeat. So I'll see you guys in, like, an hour. So I'll see you in a second. For you guys. Hey, guys. I decided to cut back so you guys can see what I'm talking about by the storm incoming. This is all the noise they're going to make when there's 40 of them doing this. Oh, God. What is this storm? Usually you can tell if it's going to be a lightning storm. You'll see it. Uh, sandstorm, not so much. 
But I'm going to take the Argentavis out and just collect them all and throw them in a big box and just aim them all at once. So I'll be back when I get more Jaraboas. And I'm back, ladies and gentlemen. So I built a little house on the side of our house for uh, the Jaraboas. I just threw them all down in this area with my Argentavis. Came back and started taming. So we got quite a few now. Uh, let's see. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 14, 15? We got 15 in a corner now. I mean, all the names. But anyways, guys, yeah, I'm going to basically try and fill this house with Jeroboas. I might start breeding them. I might start doing some crazy things. Let me know what you guys think I should do. If there's an area I should be going to to make this a little bit easier of a process. Let's, you know, you guys can be separated a little bit. I mean, I'm sure Havoc's going to take a few as he kills them off. But, uh, yeah, I want to... I want to make a multiplied population, you know. I just want this to be like a giant sound room whenever there's a sandstorm and whatnot. But, guys, th that's where I'm going to end today. Thank you for stopping by for the Jeroboa Army. I have a demo, guys. Have a wonderful night.